Yeah, really interesting. I mean, the New South Wales coroner came out with 25 recommendations. Uh, the Premier has rejected five of them, through the three top ones being pill testing pilot in New South Wales, the other one looking at strip searching and also sniffer dog. So three very controversial, very important um, things to consider and instead going with um, amnesty bins, which essentially is relying on young people to go to a particular area and throw away their drugs. It doesn't deal with anything to do with the fact that they wanted to take it in the first place. It's not really educating at all. It's just like, hey, chuck it over your shoulder and run in and listen to music. Because you, do, you work with youths, yeah. right? And, and a lot of the critics say the kids aren't throwing these drugs away anyway, so they're not about to now. So the amnesty bins are probably going to go empty. No. I mean, I think the thing that really came out for us is what the coroner found of those six deaths that we saw is there are three commonalities with them all. Uh, there was no drug addiction. Their friends didn't know how to recognise the signs that things were getting bad. And the people, who, the young people who died who took them had no idea of the effects that were going to happen because of the drugs, which are all things that pill testing does. Is It, it gives informed decision making to the person person who has a drug in their hand and says, do you really want to put this in your body? And that's what we really need is that education for young people who we know don't necessarily listen to general uh, general health warnings. Mm -hmm. And pill testing, what it does is it brings like service providers who know how to talk to young people to the festivals, talks with them, gives them the information that they need. And the ACT um, trial saw that about 42% change their consumption habits because of being part of the pill testing pilot. So that's kind of really what we want to see, which is why the coroner and the AMA have said it's a good idea. Uh, sadly, uh, the Premier in New South Wales is not willing to go back. She said, absolutely not, I'm not willing to consider it. So She sees it as green lighting. Yeah, look, at mm. least the education changes will, will be a, a start to 